Hi guys, it's Yads and welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, what's up? Hello, it's Graham, stick around for more. We are doing a Wish haul. That's right. In today's video, we are partnering with Wish to bring you this Wish office haul. I have completely revamped my office. It, um, it was terrible. It was empty. It needed some personality. So Wish reached out to me and asked if I would like to partner with them and create a video using their products. And I just knew this was the one. I just knew that this would be the perfect Wish office this haul. There is so much stuff on Wish, like you guys know, that Wish is very affordable and it's just full of the most random things you never knew you needed until you find them there. And something I didn't know about Wish as well is they also have Wish Express. Yeah, that's a thing. So not only is there the normal Wish version, there is also Wish Express. That's right, you can get your items express. So now you guys know, there is no need to wait. You can just express it. You're welcome. You are welcome. Without further ado, let's just, let's just jump into the video. So here is a before of the office. It is sad basically empty. There is nothing in here. It's just sad. There's just no personality in here. We needed staff to fill it and make it feel more like an office. <laughs> like a workspace I actually wanted to be in. The first thing I knew that I need to get from Wish was these LED signs. Now, I didn't even know Wish did LED signs, but they do, and oh my god, are they amazing. The first one I have is this lightning bolt. I just think it looks so cool. I've seen a few of them around, and there was this pink, this blue, there's loads of different kinds of colors that you can get, but I chose the um, the standard yellow because uh, I'm standard. I feel like it really goes well on this wall, especially. I feel like it's like a big collage of stuff. I also got a cloud version of this, so again, I got it in the warm light. I felt like in the warm color, it just looked a little bit more subtle. So I want something that would like blend, but still look pretty, you know? I wanted it, I wanted it, but not like too much. The cloud LED light was only 12 pounds and the lightning bolt was 16 pounds. So both really similar in price. Not only are they affordable, they also come as battery or as a USB. So you don't have to just plug them in. If you want to do, you can just put some batteries in and like they're done, they're there. I'll just talk about my favorite LED light. This is the hello sign. This, uh, this sign, I knew I needed it. I love it, it is gorgeous. Just, it is huge. It's a lot bigger than I expected it to be as well, which is a pleasant surprise. I thought it was going to be really tiny, but it, but it's not. She's big. So this is in pink and white. It looks so cute. I love this. This was originally in my streaming setup, but uh, I've moved that around now. So this one was a little bit more expensive just because there's more going on, and obviously she's a lot larger. But I will say, money well spent. So this one was twenty nine pounds. I did have a small issue with the hello sign when it came. I opened it. There was a really small crack going down it, and I was so sad. I was like, oh. But to be honest, it's not really that noticeable. I look at it now, I can't even see it. But I did communicate with customer service and I asked them, I just wondered what I could do about it. And they were really kind, they were really helpful and they offered me a full refund, completely refunded it. So there you go. But the customer service was honestly amazing and I'm really pleased with the outcome. So, so the next items that we'll talk about are the picture frames. I got three picture frames in total. I got an A3, an A4 and an A5 picture frame. So I got all the different sizes because I wanted to make sure that they all came in good quality and they look so cute. I ordered all of mine in white. There were other colors available too. There was pine and I think there was black as well. So if you wanted to go with whatever theme yours is, there are options. For the A3 picture frame, I paid £9. For the A4, I paid £15. And then for the A5, I paid £13, which sounds weird because it sounds like it should be a different order, but it's not. So that's how much I paid for them. I still think for picture frames, that was a really reasonable price. And um, not only did I get picture frames, I also got pictures. I just want to put it out there. Wish do amazing quality pictures. Yeah, I didn't know that Wish even sold like actual pictures that you can put in the frames and make it look really aesthetic and pleasing, but they do. And all I can say is I wish I ordered more. That is how good they are. We'll talk about the first one, which is the desert landscape one. This one was only £5.81p. That is more than affordable. That's the cheapest picture I think I've ever bought. And the quality of it genuinely is amazing. It's not even just on a piece of paper either. It's fully printed onto a print and the quality is high res. She is where she belongs longs now and I will be ordering more. So the pictures that I put in the next frames were basically a collage of photos. They are all amazing quality and they all come on like this really thick kind of card. One of my favorites naked. There is a ridiculous amount of pink pictures. For £13 you get 30 of them and I am just so pleased with them. So in the A4 frame I put four pictures that I all thought were similar enough and similar in colour that it looked quite 
cute, they're cohesive. It just looks super cute. We've got some flowers, some cactuses. I just love it. I think it looks super cute. And then in the smaller frame, I just put a picture of a cactus. I don't know why, but I just love the desert and I love cactuses. I just, just really wanted pictures of them, apparently. <laughs> there were also blue aesthetic. There was purple aesthetic. I just feel like there's lots of things that you can do with them and create this really cool aesthetic. Not only did I get things that you can hang on the wall, I also got things that look cute. So. I got one of these little statue things. That was a fantastic description of what that was. So uh, this is David and uh, he's a statue. It does say in the description, it's a makeup slash um, pen holder. It's got a little, little hole so that you can put stuff in, but I think he looks so cute as a little decoration piece that I've just put him on my shelf. But again, super great quality and it looks super aesthetically pleasing. Definitely looks like a piece of stone chilling in the back. So we love David. This was only 11 pounds. I think this is more than reasonable considering these kind of things are really trendy I definitely think I would probably use this to put flowers in more than pens or pencils I just think it'd look a little bit cuter with some maybe a few like little daisies or something just sticking out of it I don't know you're adorable another one that I got this one is probably my favorite one that I got and there were lots of different versions on Wish but I really wanted this one just because I like this got a little pout she's got a little belly button and she has a booty it's like you know subtle apparently I have an obsession with putting flowers and body parts do I need help? It's a possibility. But she just looks like a Glendon to me. And she was only 16 pounds and she's huge. I mean, look how much space we have in here as well. Yeah, get yourself one of these vases, you want one. So a huge issue that me and Kai have in the office is cable management. We are terrible at managing cables and there are cables everywhere. It's stressful, but I spent some time and I had a look on the office supplies on Wish and there was a ridiculous amount of cable management. So I ordered them. So the first thing we got, this looks very unattractive in the packaging. Let me get them out. Are these really adorable little clips. So basically they just go around the wires and then there is some double-sided tape that you can stick onto the back of these and you just put them them along the back of the desk. It's as simple as that. And we literally used two of these and it managed the whole entire setup. Like all the wires have disappeared. It looks so clean. I didn't even know a desk could look this nice. I thought it was just something we were gonna have to live with, but now it's beautiful. And these clips were only 71p. 71p. And it is literally a game changer. Another weird thing that I didn't realize I needed were these. They are these little magnetic tie-ups. So basically you get your wire or whatever and you basically wrap it around uh, and it just keeps it out of the way and they look super cute so you're not going to lose them and because they're magnetic they're not sticky they're not leaving any residue and they're not noisy because I feel like the velcro ones are just noisy and they just don't look as cute but these these are adorable and I love them and for a pack of five they were just 72p get some okay the next few things that I got were things that I like to use in my notebooks um I am a I'm a planner so I went ahead and ordered myself some stickers these were 79p for 25 stickers 79p do you know how expensive stickers are you probably don't because i'm pretty sure most 22 year olds don't go around buying stickers but they're expensive they're like three pounds for a pack and you're like i'm gonna buy them anyway but for 79p you get some really cute scented confusing ones look at this little milk thing i don't even like milk but i want this very relevant so girl power there was lots of different styles so definitely check them out if you are here into stickers or planning or just stickers <laughs> and the last thing that i got pens you can never have enough pens so i got the Cancer star sign. This is a pack of five, but um, Kai has lost two already, so we're down to three. So I've held on to these for dear life to film this video. The reason I love these pens and I felt like I need to conclude these in the video is the nib. With pens, I really have an obsession with nibs, and sometimes with a gel pen, they smudge, they push too hard onto the page to actually get any ink out. I don't know if that makes sense to anybody else. They write really similar to like an inkwell pen. I don't know if that makes any sense. They write really well and it feels nice to write with. So I'm just saying, if you want to get some really good pens, they had all the star signs, they also had multiple star signs, and these were only three pound. That is amazing value for pens. You want a good pen nib? Three pound on Wish. As you can see, we have really, we've really gone ham on this. I wanted something that wasn't too super crowded, but had a little bit of personality. And I feel like we've definitely achieved that. And like I said, there is a million things on Wish that you can get. Use the Express. Everything that I have bought today, I will link in the description down below so you can pick yourself up some stuff. But that's it. So I really hope you guys enjoyed the video. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Comment down below what your favorite part was. So let me see you, bye.